now we are going to teach you the next tool which is called the text tool using this text tool you can write whatever you want on a any background or a white background for that reason we have to open a new file okay now maximize that file choose the text tool and draw a rectangle and write whatever your text like image one text press enter now we can see you first you have to select the move tool we to move that one to a proper position like the center position now using the text tool we can move we can't move that image whatever the text now you have to choose the color for that reason the color palette is appearing now we can click any one of the color like a red blue green anyone and press ok now there is another options which is called the font selections the first one is Arial you have to select the Arials continuously by pressing the down arrow whichever font is most suitable with your background or with your image now we can change the text size the maximum size is written over here the 72 but if you want more than that you have to give the value through keyboard press enter now you already increase the size of text now now we can close this file press no now we are going to teach you the next most important tool which is called the pen tool it is actually particularly used to draw something for the reason we have to open a new file press ok maximize it select the pen tool and put first point which is called the vertex second vertex and make the curve using the axis and hold the alt key you can remove the first axis and then second one you can make the shape according to your choice once again press the alt key click over the one and once again giving the next vertex point holding the alt key press over the next vertex point same thing holding the alt key press holding the now the whole total selection is over now using this paint tool you can draw any on anything whatever you feel any shape you can adjust this thing using the path selection you can move whatever that you already made you can copy it or you can free transform the whole selections according to your size holding the shift key proportionally press enter now you can move the whole shape wherever you can put it now using the next option direction selection tool now using direct selection tool you can't move the whole shape but you can move only the axis of one particular vertex one by one if you wanted to move you wanted to change the shape of the particular shape you can morph it using the to pulling the axis according to your choice now the other options within the pen tool it's a 
add the anchor tool that means you can add if you want anything extra point you can just click over the shape it will just consider as another point now press the path selection tool or the direct selection tool now pulling the one vertex axis you can change that particular vertex point and make your shape perfect select the delete anchor tool you can delete any point the first point or anything whatever the point you want to delete that particular point you can just pressing that particular vertex now we can select the co convert path tool before showing that one we have to delete this one now once again we are drawing a new shape this is the first vertex this is the second vertex third fourth vertex and we are joining that one with the first one now now the last line is little bit zigzag to select the fourth one we can pull towards the right hand side and make adjust to make one straight line now it looks like a square now using the convert point tool we can pull the both axis and make it curve all the point all the corner side we can make it curve we can rotate this one as a 360 degree now just press one left key we can come back to the same previous position and you can get the square now we are selecting using the path selection tool the whole shape is selected press delete to delete the shape now closing that file press no 